This is Joey. Joey is 22 years old and wants to tell his story about the foster care system. Joey was three years old when he and his siblings were placed in a children's home in Denton, Texas. He remained in this home until he was nine years old. His father at that time was able to gain custody of Joey. During Joey's stay in the home, all family connection with his mother and her parents were dissolved. Joey's father was able to keep Joey from the age of 9 to 12, where at that time he released his right to DHS in Oklahoma. This is where Joey's story begins. At the age of 12, Joey was placed into DHS care. So it was a town called Dare, Oklahoma, and I went into just um, a whole lot of foster homes and a lot of them felt like I could call home and felt safe and the environment was good. And, but it was just like I was going through DHS and every time that I felt like I was safe, DHS always made that phone call that I never did want to get where DHS I always said that your dad did everything, he can have you back. And it was just the same thing that I was going through all the time. Joey tells us about the home he went to live in when he was 15. The best home that I could call because it was Paula Brooks was a mom. She, every time I needed something, when I walked through that door, she took me out of my room. I set my stuff, stuff down and it was everything that I could call home. It, it wasn't I didn't have to think, it was just that I was there, I was home. I felt that I could call her mom and yeah. I talked to the foster mom a couple times a week and see how I was doing and to still this day she still calls me son and I still call her mom because it was the most, she she gave me a mom feeling that I wanted, like any time I had trouble in school, it was fixed. It was all the way it wanted to be. Joey acknowledges that without foster care, he probably would not be alive. When the abuse started, it was when I was really young, it was with my dad and it was, it he would do not, um, number, I mean, it was his anger level. It was when he got mad, he always took it out on, on um, me. And he always kicked me, pulled my hair. Almost everything you can imagine done to a child that I've done. But then when I found that foster care, and then when foster care like came in, it was that if it wasn't for foster care, like I said, my dad abused me so much that I wouldn't be how I am. I wouldn't be the person I am because foster care basically saved my life. Joey feels that it's his purpose in life to tell his story, to let people know that the foster care system is good and that it needs more families to love on children in need just like him. But. We need a lot of Christian and caring families to step up to for the foster um, system where they can love and carry um, on that because that's how I am, the, who I am today because of foster care. If it wasn't for foster care, I wouldn't be where I am today.